T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, ignition, engines full power, and liftoff of SpaceX Falcon 9, go Falcon, go Starlink. Stage one propulsion is nominal. At T plus 30 seconds, Falcon 9 has successfully lifted off from Space Launch Complex 40 from the Cape at 11.50 p.m. Eastern Time. Power and telemetry nominal. This is followed by stage separation, which is when the first and second stages separate. Then we have SES-1, or second engine start one, where we light the Merlin vacuum engine on the second stage. And lastly, we'll have fairing separation, which is when the two fairing halves separate and fall away from stage two. So keep an eye out for these events, which will happen in quick succession. Main engine cutoff. Stage separation confirmed. And back ignition. And there we had Miko followed by stage separation and SES-1. Coming up shortly will be fairing separation. Fairing separation confirmed. And there we heard and saw those two fairing halves separating and falling away from the second stage. Both of the fairing halves that flew on tonight's mission are flight proven, with one half flying for the ninth time and the other flying for its tenth. And we will be attempting to recover both fairing halves using our recovery vessel, Doug. Stage one landing burn. And there's stage confirmation. Two, terminal guidance. There's confirmation that the stage one landing burn has started in preparation for touchdown on our drone ship, a shortfall of gravitas. Keep an eye out for the landing legs that are scheduled to deploy just moments before the landing. Stage one, landing leg deploy. Stage one, landing confirmed. And there you have it, Falcon 9 has successfully landed, marking its 16th landing for this booster. And we are now awaiting second engine cutoff coming up in a few seconds. MBAC shut down. Tonight's landing of our first stage marks our 207th overall landing of an orbital class rocket and our 246th mission to date for tonight's mission. Expected loss of signal cape. Nominal orbit insertion. And there's that call out for nominal orbital insertion. Now, as mentioned earlier in the webcast, tonight's launch marked the last launch of all V1.5 Starlink satellites. A huge thank you and congratulations to the entire Starlink team here at SpaceX. We